What's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. Consider subscribing to watch me play some retro and new games. Comment below any game suggestions and enjoy the video. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another NBA 2K23 My Team Playthrough. Back with another game of Domination today up against the New York Knicks. That's a 15 point win needed which is a bit higher than the last couple but that's fine. A couple of objectives we're looking towards ticking off are to get the full Evo of Chet Holmgren, Johnny Davis and Jalen Williams. Um, so basically Holmgren needs points and blocks, Davis needs points and steals, Williams needs points and assists, as well as trying to get some point guard steals, point guard threes, Spurs layups. Spurs assists and to win seven games with five Spurs players in my team, which I currently have now. They're on my bench. So hopefully we can work towards ticking some of those off. We're on level 39, so we're about 10k off hitting level 40, so getting that pink diamond Scotty Pippen. So let's do it and hopefully make it look easy. Let's go. Now the starting group for the visitors. At the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Fournier the two, Barrett at the small forward, and it's Brunson in at the one. Now here's Fournier to the paint. Here's Randall. The offensive rebound. Barrett can't hit. Leonard against Randall. There's Davis with the three. No good. New York goes the other way with it. Barrett with it. Some solid defense from Williams. Davis with it. Picked up by Fournier. Ooh, stolen by Fournier. Randall finds Brunson. Tipped. Pass to Holmgren. Outside, Williams. Here's Holmgren. Robinson defending. Oh, he powers right through the defender for the dunk. Draws the foul, too. And he'll go to the line. They'll pin that one on Julius Randle. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Back to Fournier. Now here's Brunson. He's guarded closely. Down to five on the shot clock. It's deflected. Goes back up. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. And it's time to take another look at that powerful block. And that kind of rejection early on energizes your squad. The coaching staff just loves this kind of hustle. Williams on the wing. Guarded by Barrett. Oh, Robinson with a block. And they're able to recover. And that one's good. Holmgren. Holmgren's gone two for three from the field. They swipe it. Pass to Davis. And finished off by Davis. Adding insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. <laughs> Once he poked it away, you knew what was on his mind. Now here's Brunson. Now here's Randall. Outside Fournier. Six on the shot clock. Shoots over Holmgren. The shot by Fournier, no good. I think the defense will live with him taking mid-range jumpers. But maybe just a little bit more resistance. You can really feel the momentum swinging in their direction. Yeah, but they can't relax. they got to keep building on this lead because it is not safe. Now a timeout called by New York. And Kawhi Leonard, one of three perimeter players to win back-to-back -back Defensive Player of the Year awards. It's him, Sidney Moncrief, and a young Dennis Rodman. Hartenstein, he's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Brunson. 
Now here's Randall. Randall draws the double. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. That's a jump ball! For his career, Kawhi Leonard has more steals than fouls, Grant. You know, B.A., he and Jimmy Butler, I believe, are the only two players to achieve that after a decade in the league. A pretty remarkable achievement. Boy, it's been a minute since they last scored. It has been. And at what point do you alter your strategy? Try to get back on track. Quickly passes to Fournier. To the middle. Kicks it out to Barrett. Shot clock at two. From deep. Rebounded by Kawhi Leonard. Outside, Williams. No good from outside. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. And stolen by Williams. Pass to Holmgren. And it's good for two. Holmgren's got nine points. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. They got off to such a hot start, and that can keep you energized throughout the whole game. Now here's Fournier. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard, and it's quickly with a miss. Down low. Pass to Bowen. Here's West. Can't drop the tough three-pointer. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Quickly, outside. 43 seconds left in the first quarter. Clock at six. No, oh, no good! Unable to end this run. Takes it inside. And Williams punches it home. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really set the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. Now a timeout called by New York. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. I'm sure Coach is going to give them an earful about that. He can't be happy with that soft interior D. But man, the defender really went after him. Low. And he drops it first. Team second. Shooting. And Williams drops them both. Every trip up the floor gets more and more important. Yes, indeed. They badly want to stop the bleeding here. To the right side. Here's Bowen. Reddish covering. Holmgren. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It goes on Obi Toppin. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. It's both from the stripe. Here's Rose. One second left. And he hits the jump shot. Smart play from Rose, getting up close to the basket for a high percentage look. That was pretty close to a perfect quarter. <laughs> they had to score right at the end there. <laughs> 0.2 seconds left or whatever. Derek Rose hit the tough shot over Chet Holgram. We're going to have a quick check out of that quarter because 7 of 12 shooting, so not great shooting for me. 58% is still pretty good, but. Aside from that one turnover to their five, played beautiful defense, got the two blocks, four steals. Just unfortunate that they had to score right at the end there, otherwise so it would have been a scoreless quarter. quarter. Oh, 19 to two, we'll seven see point, 17 point lead, sorry. And from what we've seen Going here into the, the second team, quarter, so let's do so it. Far. Hopefully so it continues that way. That first quarter was all about leaking out and capitalizing in transition. It leads to some easy buckets, and I think it's given them control of the pace in this one. Davis out there with Ivy. And then there's Jakob Pertl, and it's Williams in at the small forward position. And for the Knicks, we've got Toppin. He's out there with Cam Reddish. And it's Rose in at the point. Transition basketball, the most reliable way to generate easy looks. Yeah, when you hustle on a break like he does, good things tend to happen. 
checking in with the away Ivy's team. out there with Davis. Then there's Jakob Pertl, and it's Williams Robinson. in at the three. The small forward. Reddish passes to Robinson. Here's Brunson. Stolen by Davis. And for the Knicks. They've got Jalen Brunson. Will be topping out there with Mitchell Robinson. Then there's Cam Reddish. And it's Grimes in at the two spot. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. They're yeah, taking the onus on himself to make something happen. Got it into the teeth of the defense and made them pay. Back to Reddish. Clock at four. From 15 feet away. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. First personal foul. The first one falls. Julius Randle's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Grimes. He's off on the second. Tipped. Here's Davis. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Davis has got six. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. That's a great possession. Put your best players in a position to succeed. Davis against Brunson. And he's going for the oop here. It's stolen by Pirtle. And here comes the break. And Davis with the basket. On the assist from Williams. Williams has got three assists in the game. Any hope of coming back to win this game looks near impossible. I know. The way things have gone so far, hard to imagine. Back to Brunson. Who poked away. Four on the clock. Ooh, he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Well, one of the free agent moves that wasn't surprising was Brunson joining the Knicks. The two were enamored with each other early on in the process. A big signing for the Knicks, and Brunson now gets a chance to be a main piece of the team. Hardenstein, he's checked in for New York. Barrett comes in for Reddish. Their offense is looking like a well-oiled machine, getting any look they want. Right about that. Seems like they haven't missed. Now a timeout called by New York. Failing to find a rhythm offensively. Something that needs to change and change soon. And Coach called his timeout to try and reset things on offense. Shake them up a bit so they can hopefully start getting some shots to fall. Fournier's checked in for Brunson. Quickly outside. to Randall and he's in the books now one for two yeah and anytime there's contact in there with Randall he usually gets the best of it who was stolen by 48 and here's the fast break here's quickly Davis for the rebound he was so well positioned to interfere with the shot textbook defense take a good two angle to the shooter and the bother the release oh and can't hit and here's New York now. Randall finds quickly. 146 left in the second. Pass to Fournier. Five to shoot. Shoots from 12. Here's Hardenstein. Davis on the double team. And it's going to be a three-second call. That's a costly error. Now let's see how they bounce back. Well, they don't have time to dwell on that. They just need to learn from their mistakes and move forward. Next play. Holmgren, he's checked in for Pirtle. Here's Bowen, guarded by Barrett. That is a perfect placement of that time. Just guided it right to him. When you're casual with the ball, it can come back to bite you. The NBA playing loose can help you and hurt you. They really need to tighten it up. To the inside. And he jams it home with authority. And if you try to block his shot, you risk getting posterized because he is good at using that height to his advantage. Rose, the pass to Fournier. Here's Sims. to the middle and there's a whistle he'll head to the line to shoot two second personal foul team four 
shooting. That free throw misses. So both teams changing it up here. Two shots. Good on the second one. On the wing, Davis. And finished off by Davis. <laughs> Leaving absolutely nothing on the table right now. Their focus and execution has been outstanding. It's caused them to pull away a bit. Let's see if they can keep the train on the tracks. Fournier finds Rose. Here's Grimes. Away team foul. McBride, he's checked in for New York. Sam. First personal foul. Checking in for the away team. Here's Miles Bowen. McBride. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Pass to Holmgren. Over to the wing. To the paint. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. And guys, to go on a big run, get some breathing space. It has to be a great play on each end. Oh, and the release was before the buzzer. Well, well there's half time. 30 point lead. A bit cool better of a quarter there. for them that quarter. The Five Tennessee points instead of two points. Um, we'll yeah, half. it's a pretty handy lead to have at quarter time. At half time, sorry. All three of my evolution players that I'm trying to get up seem to be playing pretty well. Let's have a look. Holmgren, 17 points and two blocks. That's great. A couple of posterizations, which is nice. Davis, 12 points and one steal. Get a few more steals. Will be nice. Eight points and three assists for Williams. No one else has scored, so it's good. Got some assists with Bowen. And so Chan, which is exactly what I need. Spurs assists. Just need a couple laps with a couple Spurs players, and it'll be nice. But I need a point guard that steals as well. Jerry West has one, and Ivy has two. I need point guard threes, so I might take a couple threes with them. We'll see. All right, second half. It's 30 point lead, so 50 points is probably the minimum I'd want to win by, so let's do it. And here's New York now. We've got Davis. Holmgren is out there with Kawhi Leonard. And it's Williams in at the small forward position. And that's the group for Mike Budenholzer as we begin the second half. And so the ball out of bounds. Fournier touched it last. Outside Davis, pass to Holmgren, outside Williams. Over to the left wing, here's West. No good on the three. The ball's knocked loose. Outside Davis. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul and he'll take two free throws now. It's going to go on Mitchell Robinson. The officials were right on top of that one. He hits the second from the line. And here's Brunson. Outside Barrett. Outside Brunson. Here's the floater. And he sinks the layup. The floater is so tough to defend against. Nothing defenders can really do but shake their heads. And we just had to see that mobile one drive one more time. Great stuff. Yeah, he has that fight in him. Love the aggression at the rim when they are trying to claw back into the game. And here's New York now. Brunson passes to Barrett. And here is Fournier. There's the drive. Shot from 12. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. Williams against Barrett. Davis. Oh, a beautiful reverse layup. Davis has got 15 points. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. Outside Fournier. Davis on the double team. Outside Fournier. Shot from the top of the key. And misses it off the right side of the rim. 
I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. Yeah, and the risk now is that he gets inside his own head. Time to take deep breaths uh, in through the nose, out through the mouth, and let the game come to you. Just rising up to the rim. Man, when he gets up there, he gets up there. You know what I'm saying? And we just had to take one more look at that great drive. Yeah, that's a little icing on the cake right there. Putting on a show while they enjoy a big second-half lead. And here's Brunson from the arc. Counted from Jayden distance. Brunson. Brunson's got his second basket. And what kind of defense was that? You can't give up wide open threes like that. What are you doing? And Jalen Brunson, he's a great option on the floor, Grant. <laughs> yes, he is. Can attack from different levels of the floor. Solid shooting threat from outside. Jayden and gives you another Brunson. playmaker to initiate the offense. Adding insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. <laughs> Once he poked it away, you knew what was on his mind. Two minutes remaining in the third. Pass to Barrett. Now here's Fournier. Kawhi Leonard comes up with a rebound. Leonard's got four rebounds in the game. Here's Holmgren. The shot no good. New York goes the other way with it. Here's Fournier, and they get it back. Second chance effort. Outside, Williams. From outside the arc, and counted. Now five for seven. Just good awareness from Leonard there. Feeding a wide open guy instead of forcing his own shot. Outside, Barrett. Pass to Randall. Robinson on the wing. Back to Fournier. Just five to shoot. There's the triple. On target from range. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. This is today's NBA. Hey, we see this kind of exchange more often than not. Williams from long range. They get it again. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Second personal First one foul. falls for him. Team second. Shooting. That one falls, so he hits both of them. There's 42 seconds left to play in the third quarter of basketball. Second personal foul. First team foul. The visitors with the ball. Outside Reddish. Back to Rose. Pass to Toppin. Here's Grimes. Williams defending. Six to shoot. 13 feet out. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. He did everything in his power to make that a hard shot. Excellent D. Avoided fouling and got in perfect position to alter that shot. First He's off on the first. 13 five. At the line for your home team. So he comes up empty, missing both. Rose outside. Can't connect from 14. He got it up. And no good. And three quarters of play in the books. Well, this three quarter time. Over already. Lot close to that quarter. Delivering the blowout. And fourth Still quarter 34 point lead. Be coming your way on. Oh yeah, my God, it's gone. I'll have a little And look. it's time now to bring you our State Farm. Holmgren has the four blocks, 23 points, killing it. Davis still with the one steal. I'm going to try very hard to get another one. Williams just chipping away nicely. And no one else has scored. Let's Assist do it. To the game. Fourth I'll tell quarter. You what, this was Hopefully a no we can roll it out tonight. 40 plus. But Take a look at the 50. precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. You've got to admire the vision just as much as the accuracy. Not many players can even spot that pass. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may already be out of hand. So on the floor for the Knicks. We've got Cam Reddish. He's out there with Toppin. And it's Grimes in at the two. And Reddish gets it to go. I love the throwback basketball. 
work it down low and set up your teammate. Here's Williams. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's going to go on Cam Reddish. And he can't get the first one. Quickly is checked in for Grimes. Shooting for your home. And the second free throw is good. The visitors with the ball. Pass to Toppin. Here's Reddish. Quickly outside. Home team foul. Wesley. First personal foul. First team foul. Into the lineup for your home team. Jacob Porto. Here's McBride. Quickly outside. Four on the clock. And Ivy pulls it down. One minute in now in the fourth quarter. Basket's good. Hurdle's got his first point of the game. Okay, when you let someone with this height get this close, it's going to be nearly impossible to stop, especially when he has that big of an advantage in this category. Pass to Reddish. Knocked loose. The dive for the ball. Here's Wesley, guarded by Quickly. Here's Williams. He's got it. Six of ten now. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're reeling, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. The rebounding numbers make it obvious why they're in front. They're limiting the offensive possessions for the other team. Tough to win with no extra possessions. Pass to Ivy. Now Williams. Hurdle in the post. Guarded by Quickly. The rebound by Sims. Let's a three fly. And Quickly gets the three. Quickly's gotten himself going here. His first point to the game on the deep ball. And something fans don't always get to see. Some of the closely guarded secrets that happen in that huddle. And we see it so often. One little tweak to the game plan and everything falls into place for a team. Outside Davis, pass to Holmgren. Here's Elliott, Reddish covering. Here's Holmgren. And there's the rejection. On the wing quickly, checked by Davis. And he's going for the lob. And it's going to be out of bounds. New York will have another go. He clipped the ball there, but not enough to nab the steal. That's fine. You love the effort. Not making things easy for the opposition on offense. Derek Rose, he's checked in for New York. Here's Reddish. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. No good on that one. Shooting for the away team. Cameron. And he's good on the second. If you're just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. Inside, Holmgren. And that one goes. Now 10 for 13 on the night. Love how selfless he is setting brick screens like this. Plays like that right there are what help create easy scoring opportunities. Kept alive, Sims. Can't hit from in close. They've done a great job of moving the ball tonight. Yeah, B.A., keeping everybody involved keeps everyone engaged. The three is up. West misses. Outside Reddish. Right wing. Home team foul. Hardenstein. He's checked in for New York. Grimes comes in for Reddish. 13 foul. Coming onto the floor for the wait. Well, if you're just tuning in, welcome. We played about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter here. Grimes. Pass to Grimes. Shot clock at six. Here's McBride. Out to Rose. Oh. 
Here's Grimes. Over Williams. Williams grabs the board. Boy, this could snowball if they continue to put up points. I can't say enough about their performance. West misses. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And it's going to be a goaltending call here, so they will count the bucket. Oh, boy, what control and poise from Rose. Taking the hit like a champ and just powering right through it. 52 seconds left in the game. Down low. Here's Pirtle. Ooh, good finish at the rack off a slick feed. I like the intention, the focus, finding a way to make it work inside. Pass to Grimes. Here's McBride. Rose outside. The three ball. A nice shot by Grimes. It's nice they found their rhythm here, but the clock is just not their friend. It's a shame, really. If they've been playing like this last quarter, they might be in a different situation right now. Count it. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And that score probably slams the door for any would-be comebacks. And look, they put this one to bed. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Third personal foul. And he makes a first. At the line for the away. And so he makes both from the line. Here's Ivy from deep three-point range. Second chance shot. Johnson with a bucket. Fighting down low, big fella. Johnson with some hustle points. Tipped away. Well, there's the and game. So they get the victory here Lost the last quarter in the end, but the pretty much had the holster back in the rack. Out half time. Give with it a 30 up point lead. Team. End of the game with 33 point win. You best believe against we the Knicks. Just like an easy game, really. Um, 815 my team tokens. Obviously, completed all three. Of those, Holmgren 25.7 rebounds, 4 blocks in 15 minutes, that's elite. Williams 16 points, 6 assists. Davis 15, 2, 1 and 1. 3 layouts for Paltel. 1 for Johnson. West shot 0 4. Bad game for West. A couple steals for me though, so it's not the end of the world. Ivy also a couple steals for me. Seven, eight assists for Spurs players, nine assists, nine assists for Spurs players, pretty good as well. Oh. He's injured. <laughs> good thing he's probably never going to get used again. Not really. Yeah. Until next time. Until next time, guys. Uh, hopefully. We will have gotten to level 40 by the next couple of days at least. Let's actually have a look how close we are. Just waffling now, but we might as well check how close we are to getting that pink diamond Scotty Pippen. Haven't been too lucky in any of the card packs yet so hopefully once I get one pink diamond they'll start coming in droves um, so we're about 9,300 off once these two are f these three players are fully elevated Holmgren, Williams, and then Johnny Davis. Once they're fully elevated, that's what, 2,200? So that'll put us close. So hopefully, we'll be there soon. Alright, until next time, guys. Catch ya. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to check out my page down below. Hit like on this video. Comment what games you'd like to see me try out next. And don't forget to subscribe. Peace.